Hi, my name is Mike McCoy, WD4AM from Lenore, North Carolina. How are you? As you notice on YouTube, I have various different videos of building homebrew antennas. This particular antenna here is a old direct TV dish that I converted for a Wi-Fi directional antenna. As you can see, we had a 7x7 seven seven copper plate I installed. We eliminated the LNB and mounted it, and I just used an SO239 connector behind the copper plate, and you can see the mount here. And behind here, you can see the, the reflector which we had to solder it, had to take a Brutine torch, ordinary soldering iron did not work, wasn't hot enough, and we cut the copper in two diamond shapes, oh about nine inches and three quarters, and it looks something like this here that reflects against the dish. Now, when test on this, and I haven't temporarily set it up, I have already received about nine, nine various different hotspot areas. Now you see where I live at Google is right across the Lenore, North Carolina Google facility is about four miles from here and Lenore, the town is directly north and they have hotspots, Wi-Fi is allowed to city Lenore so it's perfectly legal. But I live outside of Lenore, about, well, in Lenore, been annexed, about seven miles. So hopefully this Wi-Fi dish is going to work for me. I don't know exactly where to mount it. I got it temporary either on the house. I could put it up here on the tripod, on the house, on the side of the house. As you can see, more of my homebrew antennas, the six-meter all directional V and the 20 meter and 15 meter and the 6 meter dipo and of course the homebrew on the tower 50 foot tower 6 meter and 10 meter dipo. So I keep you informed we hope to build more antennas and designs. This is WD4AM from Lenore North Carolina with the new Wi-Fi dish. 73s.